That's right folks, you read the title correctly. It's a photography challenge, round two. Some of the boys were salty from last time, thought they should have won, so I figure it's best to give them another shot and see what they come up with this time. Different cottage, same rules, let's see what they do. Let's do this. Roll that intro. So for those of you who haven't watched the first one, I recommend you just go do that. I'll just link it up here. But the rules are simple. I'm giving the guys my camera, which I'm still terrified about even though nothing happened last time. They're gonna use the 85 millimeter lens and they have to take the best portrait of me decided by you guys. And I cannot wait to see what these guys do. We're gonna give it up to Lumbo to pick the order because he was the champ from last time. And hey, let's see what he decides. All right, I'm here with uh, Lumbo, the winner of the last photo competition. Alex, uh, what, what, what went through your mind when you won? Ecstasy, glory, satisfaction. Some people would say it's comparable to winning like a major sports championship. Do you agree? I think it's greater than that. The, that happens multiple times every year. This really only happened once ever. True, very nice. Um, now, since you are the winner, you get to decide the order of who is going to shoot. What is that order? I'm gonna go last and uh, we'll go reverse age, so youngest first. Do you have any words for your competition? Uh, let's bring the best out in one another. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> all right, viewers at home, Ruben being the youngest of our group of friends is up first. Ruben, what is your strategy? Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, still thinking about what to do here. This is, this is tough, you know? I don't have any experience doing this. I'm new to the game, so really gotta figure out what I wanna do here, gotta impress everyone. Uh, March, what would you do? Nice try, Ruben, I'm not giving uh, you any secrets. Work, eh? Yeah, no, that's uh, not gonna fly. Okay. So Ruben wasn't in the last one, but since then, since seeing the video and the pictures that were produced, he has claimed several times that he could win this competition. It's very possible. He's very confident. Rules are simple. You have this 85 millimeter lens you gotta use, portrait of me, the rest is up to you. So you're like, you get to flex your creative muscles. I really want to capture the essence of the cottage. Uh, I think, you know, that's why we're up here. Got some beautiful scenery out there. Got some great props all over. So I'm going to put some stuff together and let's see what we can get. Oh, he's going with the red chair. He knows, he knows my colors. Now, in my opinion, some people would think that going first would be a disadvantage, but I think it's actually an advantage because you have first first call on every cool idea. Anyone after that is just either biting your idea or can't do it because you've already done it. You said, what, what's the optimal distance? It's up to you. So it's us? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Got a fishing rod, very cottagey. This is getting pretty complex at this point. I think he's building a movie set. This is either gonna really blow up in your face or produce an unbelievable picture and you're gonna win by a landslide. I hope so, I really hope so. Effort, you guys gotta take effort points into consideration. <sighs> Feel pretty comfortable, built a pretty creative set that I think captures the essence of being at the cottage. So let's see how it turns out. All right, reigning champ, are you nervous about his setup at all? Yeah, it looks good. Looks really good. Looks like he's using some nice props. I don't even know where you found this stuff. Very creative. I made one of them, actually. I made the red muscovy chair. What do you think he's gonna use the fishing rod for? To be the tonal. How do you feel about your shots? Um, I feel pretty good. I mean, I actually filmed it in portrait mode, unlike the rest of the boys and all the other photos they've taken. So I think that gives me a leg up. Yep. Um, maybe next time you should put like pretty stringent requirements in, okay. so we can eliminate Just, people. Yeah, eliminate the... Yeah, okay. But I'm feeling pretty good. All right. I think well, uh, it's going to be a tough photo to beat. I appreciate the vote, guys. It was a little bit cocky with the I appreciate the vote, but hey, let's see. Your turn. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Tor, can, we borrow, can I borrow your glasses? I'm just going for the reflection. Oh, so I want to reflect. I know what he's doing. Flex right. those creative muscles. I was going to say, I might do a close up and try to get all this cottage in the glasses. Oh, okay, okay. All right, let's check this out. Let's go. We're on a we're on a mission now. It sucks like not going first because I feel like Ruben just took the best shot right there. Oh, like uh, on the dock, lake in the background. Yeah, like, but he could have absolutely botched the execution. That's true. Like you could have a good idea and just ruin the execution. Ruben, leave all that there. I'm gonna do the exact same shot. Yeah, because that's what I was thinking. It's like something on the dock, or it could be the opposite. It could be the cottage in the background, and. 
getting the reflection of the dock and everything from your glasses. Ooh. You gotta be careful that you don't get your reflection though. Yeah, that's true. Or, maybe I'll just get that on purpose. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right, I need you to sit. These are women's glasses, by the way. <laughs> oh, they don't look like women's glasses. All right, so, got these super manly glasses on. <laughs> G framed me up. Give, give us like your, the play-by-play -play of what your idea was. Um, so basically the whole idea was to show as much as you could of the lake and the water through the reflection of the glasses. That's why he has these nice ladies glasses on. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I tried to get more background of the cottage, but that didn't really work out with shifting the focus a little mm -hmm. or the depth. I saw the picture because obviously, you know, <laughs> secret privileges, but I think it turned out pretty well. We've got a couple contenders early on, so we have to move on to the next guy and see what happens. Alrighty, up next, based on the very strict age rules that Lumbo set in place, is our man, Justin. I'm ready, let's do this. What's your game plan? Kinda wanna get you on the hood of my car. You know you can do like, te you test things out, right? You know. So, yeah, we can do that. Alright, let's, let's test it. it out. You also wanna do a burnout and just have like the smoke, so. Hey man, he can do whatever he wants for his portrait. Sex appeal. Yeah. <laughs> Anybody have any body oil? You gonna move the car or are you gonna... I don't know where my keys are. Oh, okay, so we're just going in place here. <laughs> so far, Justin's the first guy to come to the front of the property, which offers some very nice, like, foresty vibes, you know? Could work in his favor, depending on how he poses me, what he chooses to do with his shot. We don't know. I wish I could get somebody in the car roasting the tires. Yeah. But I don't really trust anyone, including myself, to do that. You look pretty deep in thought. Yeah. It's a good aperture here. That, that's, that, okay, yep. Yeah. That didn't make sense, but hey. I like the focal length right here. Yeah, let's see the focal length. Yep. Just gotta adjust the f-stop a little bit. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. This is a young man we like to call photography Justin. He throws out photography terms to trick amateurs into thinking he knows what he's talking about. Sadly, it works eight out of 10 times. Let's get some RGB in here. What's going through your head right now? Take us through what you're thinking. I'm actually panicking inside right now. Does it have anything to do with the competition or is like? <laughs> no, no, it's just general feels. <laughs> oh, that's a mossy rock. Sit on the mossy rock. You want me sitting on the mossy rock? Okay, we can do that, no actually, problem. Why don't you Vanna White the rock? Like. Vanna White the Rock, okay. It's Vanna White? Yeah. yeah, Vanna White, Wheel of Fortune. For those of you at home who didn't see it, Justin actually only took two shots. Just bang, bang, he knew what he wanted, got in, got out. How confident are you in the two shots? Or Pretty confident. Shot? Pretty confident, yeah. You think, yeah. You think you have what it takes to win with that? I haven't seen the other shots, but I'm feeling pretty good. Nice. Is there anything else you'd like to tell the people at home? Yeah, just respect the environment, you know? Climate change is a, it's a big problem. <laughs> We're not gonna have mossy rocks for That's too much true, longer yeah, if, okay. uh, if we keep up this planet, so. Yeah, Yeah. so don't, don't up the planet when you're doing photo challenges. Come on, people. Next guy. He's got two thumbs and is up. This guy. Are you ready to go? Are you ready to win it this time? Yeah, we're going down to the dock. And we're just gonna cut right through this game that's going on. A portrait is a picture of me. Yeah, but yeah. from close, from far. That's up to you, that's a yeah. dealer's so choice. You are the focal point. I am the focal point. You don't wanna pull a spats from the last competition no. and take a picture of a bunch of trees. Yeah. And have half your face in it. Exactly. So what is your strategy so, knowing this? Uh, I have home court advantage. Yeah, you do. It's my cottage, obviously. And I'm gonna pull a huge flex. Huge flex. Huge flex. Okay, what is it? What is so, it? I'm excited. All these guys are around here on the property and whatever. We're going on the dock. Justin was taking a picture on the driveway, whatever. We're going on the boat. Yeah. The boat. <laughs> all right, let's do it. But I don't want them to see that, like, boom, we're getting in the boat and we're going. So we're gonna be like very sneaky. Maybe yeah. The boat here with my. Uh, I'm just gonna sneaky record you doing it. I don't want them to notice. Yeah, of course not. The reality is, even if they did notice, there's nothing they could do it, because it's your boat. Exactly. And nobody has a boating that's license why, to take this thing up. That's why it's a major flex. Plus, you've also used the idea. Like, if anybody does this after you try to do it, that's a bold move. They might not even be able to compete with the picture go. you've taken. Okay, go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, they're on to you. Casa on, just pulling out the big guns, taking the boat out. 
it's his cottage, he could do what he wants to. He wants to win it this time, ladies and gentlemen. I feel like he's a little upset that he didn't win last time, so he is pulling out all the stops. See you later, losers. <laughs> didn't really have any spot in mind that I wanted to take you, but I uh, figured this is something they couldn't do, so. There it Manage is. me. Fall in love and tear it down as soon as we wake up. Uh, one thing I didn't anticipate, uh, a lot of other boats, so it was pretty wavy, so it was tough to, to get a stable uh, grip on the camera. Um, but uh, yeah, I think this turned out pretty good. How do you think uh, you're going to stack up against the other boys uh, with this advantage here? Well, I think it's good. It definitely adds a different element, an yeah. element that they don't have in their pictures. Uh, let's see how you do in post, but... Uh, <laughs> well, if we even, even get, does, will it even look like we were on a boat? So oh, that's we'll, not true. Uh, We'll see. That's uh, that's that's your arena. Big Costa pulling out the power moves as he cruises back into the bay, and they have no choice but to just watch him do it. That was. Uh, I mean, I might be a little biased. That was the most fun of all the shots so far. But will it be the winner? There's still one more guy to shoot. The reigning champ, Lumbo. But I don't. I mean, he doesn't have a boat, so I don't see how. How does he even stand a chance? Bob should have been available to all of us. Uh, you know what? He didn't break any rules. He just he just played the game. Questionable. Yeah. Questionable. Very you questionable. You had all the props. Um, I mean, he could have still taken I mean, a very Costa bad I knows picture. something about boating, but he doesn't know too much about taking pictures, so we'll see how it goes. The boat power move was not well received from the other competitors, <laughs> but it was within the rules. And speaking of within the rules and power moves, here's our reigning champ, Lumbo. <laughs> A couple Are things have changed, a couple things haven't changed since the last time I saw you guys. Things that haven't changed, my shirt. Haven't even washed it. Same shirt I wore last time, you can flash back to it now. He's so tired of me being supreme. <laughs> that's right. And uh, things that have changed, March gave me a tattoo. Yep. I think that's about it, really. Okay, what are we doing? Oh, What's your strategy? Um, Where are we going? I want to I wanna just do something a little different. I think there's been a lot of focus on the water and the dock for good reason. Yeah. But I think I want to go the other way. I don't oh. know what Justin did, but... I have a couple ideas down yonder there. Let's go, Viv. I gotta tell you, there's some nice leading lines up ahead. That's uh that's one thing we have industry like a, tip. Yeah, leading lines. Um, again, that's something that, that Dan taught me before when, when he did my university course for me. The people at home already know that because he said that in the last one. Flashback to that one. Um, Daniel actually helped me in university. He helped me get through photojournalism, so I'm gonna use the same techniques that he taught me. These other guys have no chance. Thanks for that. <laughs> How are the other guys doing? The other guys did pretty good, man. Yeah, uh, it's definitely been stepped up since the last competition. I'll tell you that for free. Okay, nice. I don't want to steal Justin's shot, so tell me if I'm doing something. You don't know what Justin's shot was, and I'm not going to tell you because that, you know, it's a new element. Do you know where the cornfield is? No idea. All right. Lumbo has just indicated that he wants to go to the cornfield. However, I don't think there's a cornfield in the middle of cottage country. I think we found the cornfield, ladies and gentlemen. Up this hill and around the corner, lots of corn. Oh baby, might be here. This could be it. I don't think it's a cornfield. I think it's just an open field. That'll do. Okay. I don't even know if we're gonna use it. I like this trail right here. Beautiful trail. It is a nice trail. Whoa! Look at this guy just breaking all my camera equipment. No. That is no way to win the, the viewers over. Ladies and gentlemen at home, what do you think? Does that help his cause or does that hurt his cause that he's damaging my stuff? I want you kind of facing this way. I'll be behind you. You're just looking, walking will make you look cool. Cooler than you are, which is tough. Pretty cool guy. Yeah, haters. Cool guy. All right, let's do it. I found this, this, whatever this is. And um, it's a nice contrast because you get the man-made structures in nature. So a nice juxtaposition there. Then I started to want to frame him with leaves. I remember like leading lines, but I also remember like the out of focus leaf or whatever the object is right in front is really going to frame his face nicely. That was my thought process. It was tough. The camera is heavy. You have to get the, the right angle. It was, it was difficult. It was tough, but I think it looked real nice. You know what? I, I didn't have a boat, so I had to make, make do with what I had and oh buoy, I think I did. <laughs> oh my God. I was gonna say that your photos were really good, but those puns just, let's just say if this were a game of Jenga, you would be in the stack. Yeah. I am glad I'm playing the same game as everybody else. That's usually a good sign. Yep. Listen, all of you were impressive. Mm -hmm. I think Costa had the most approved going into this one because he didn't feel like he got a fair fight last time. So he pulled a 
huge power move and he surprised me to be honest but all of you guys produced some pretty impressive pictures for nice. not photographer photographers yeah and I I'm excited to see each of them Costa has the boat Justin came out this way I'm excited for that you don't know what he did I don't know what he did yeah the other guys were by the, the water Ruben used props he pulled things out of the cottage I didn't even know existed yep geez G has he's just the natural uh, videographer photographer so we got some tough tough things ahead but for me defending champion I promise to bring you more glory success and love all right folks that's all there is for this photography competition check out the photos here they are vote for your favorites down in the comments below let's see if we've got a new winner or does Lumbo defend his title Costa making power moves Ruben using props everybody's getting creative I love it make sure you're subscribed like the video and I'll see you guys in the next one love you